In 1903, Orville and Wilbur Wright successfully built and flew the world's first motor-powered aircraft in a flight that lasted a grand total of 12 seconds. Since then, aviation has really taken off. Today, millions of people take to the skies every day, flying all around the world. Keeping these planes flying safely and airports running smoothly requires a huge range of professionals. From the well-known roles of pilots, cabin crew, air traffic controllers and engineers, to lesser known occupations in safety, compliance and air transport management. Members of Cranfield University are keen to share their insights into these wide-ranging career opportunities. Over the course of his career as a pilot, Rob has flown military jets on the front line of war zones, transported goods and passengers around Europe in commercial planes, and educated students about the intricacies of flight in Cranfield's own aircraft. Aeronautical engineers are responsible for designing and testing all aspects of an aircraft, which involves everything, from the electronics in the navigation system to the turbines in the engines. Simon, a mechanical engineer with a background in flight dynamics, has previously studied helicopter gearboxes and worked with radar communications as an engineer in the Royal Air Force. Airports function thanks to the work of check-in agents, security officers, baggage handlers, air traffic controllers, technicians and fleet managers. Anne has spent many years managing the aircraft fleets and operations of commercial airlines, which involve checking aircraft performance, ensuring all aircraft were maintained and training crew. Safety is a top priority in aviation, so every part of the industry includes roles to ensure that flying is as risk-free as possible. As an aviation safety and compliance manager, Rhiannon monitors the safety of Cranfield's aircraft and flights to identify any potential hazards before they become a safety concern. The aviation industry is infamous for its contribution to climate change, which is why there are now a huge number of roles aimed at improving its negative environmental impacts. Thomas specialises in aviation sustainability and is hopeful that new technologies such as using hydrogen as a zero emissions fuel to power planes will help to reduce the industry's carbon footprint. As you can see, there is a wealth of opportunities available in the world of aviation. Whether you dream of flying a plane, building a helicopter, managing an airline, keeping people safe while flying or improving the sustainability of the industry. What could you achieve with a career in aviation?